completely new, mind-blowing summoner technology that I guarantee you've never seen before. A build so unique and so powerful, it even blew Northern Lion away. Oh, fly, that's neat. Turkey, turkey, tiger, fly, wow, cool build. Whoa, have you guys seen this? Whoa, dude, epic, epic for the win, turkey, tiger, fly. That's right, boys, turkey, fly. I know, it sounds insane, right? Why would they work well together? You would never think it, but yes, the turkey and fly actually make a great summoner combo. In fact, I would consider the build you're about to witness literally summoner perfection. It's basically unbeatable. Sheep, fly, and turkey, it really doesn't get more unique and cool than this build. Okay, but jokes aside, this summoner build actually is really cool because I used front penguin, which comboed insanely well with turkey fly because it actually gives you a place to summon stuff. It's just really good. Okay, enjoy the video. Oh, dude, what a terrible start. I guess we're doing a uh, horse, cricket, and then honey. It's not too bad. Could be worse. Overexcited shirts? No, I'm... I'm a talkative fireman. I like talking when I'm putting on fires. It's my favorite thing. Ooh, wait. Uh, no, we, we fucking... Won't. We, wait. We draw? No, we just, we just... Another cricket, though. Yo, maybe summon strat? Uh, I'm gonna freeze ant roll. Uh, sure. Sure. I guess we're just going summon strat. Screw ants. Don't need them. No one likes them anyway. Did you guys know that, uh, ants can lose their path and walk around in a circle and just die because they get lost and they just literally walk around in a circle endlessly until they die. I just learned that today. It's pretty crazy. Uh, do we draw? Yes, we do. We'd be drawing on here. Turn three so I can combine the horse and get a tier three unit. I'm not sure if it's worth it, but considering I don't like any of these units, I'll roll once. Give me another horse. Oh, uh, I'm gonna combine. Ooh, rabbit. Rabbit's good. Rabbit's always good. Rabbit gives you health. Everyone loves health. And then... Watch this. No, 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 no. Boom. Neat stick. Now no one can mess with this man. If we do not lose, if we don't win this round, I will be absolutely astonished. Get a mosquito. Four damage. Cricket. I don't know why it's a mosquito. Uh, I think I might be able to. Easy. Wait, where'd all my health go? My rabbit. Wait, was that a mosquito? Am I losing my brain? Am I losing all my brain cells as we speak? Yeah. Uh, that's a lot of beavers right there, but I don't want no beavers. No T.Y. No uh, I think we go Peacock. I think we Peacock Meatbone. We do this. This is actually this is actually the clutch play. Now there's no way we lose. All right. All right. Um. No, we still we still draw here because the crickets won the crickets. Unfortunate. Uh, this is. Mm, don't buff that beaver. Yeah. All right. Easy win. Not even remotely close. All right. So, wow. This is a good turn. Okay, so the question is, is do we get rid of the crickets? The crickets have six gold invested in them each is the problem. Meat bone and honey. These are six gold worth, so we're gonna get one gold back. This also has a lot of gold invested into it. The thing that doesn't have a lot of gold invested into it is this rabbit as it's still a three two. I would really like, these are all really good pets right now for our build. Uh, we have three slots open. We could get four gold here and buy all those pets if there are upgrades. Okay, I think we get rid of the honey. Right, we keep the meat bone, the meat bone's good. We might transition to someone build, but I don't really want to. So I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this really weird thing where I actually don't buy either of these really good units. Um, and I think we just... I think the play here is to buff the Peacock is the safest play. But I don't know if we really want to keep it around, so I'm gonna... The Sheep is the best summon unit out of these, so I'm just gonna buff the Sheep. And I would roll, but I feel like 1-1s one are fine here, because I, I don't really want to replace anything. That's actually fine. Yo, this guy's getting rolled. Absolutely rolled. Sir, you need to try... You need to be better than that, okay? Come out really that weak, weak sauce like that, man? Ooh, ooh, sure. Go ahead. Ox is interesting too. Ox is definitely a better peacock in this situation by a lot. Probably already better than the peacock. Literally, even with the gold investment in him. I'll roll here. Yeah, I still think the ox is literally better than the peacock, even with all that gold. Like, he just is. He's just, he's just, he's just god tier. God tier pet. Ooh, wow, level, level two sheep already. If we get a level three horse, and then we get rid of the cricket for a turkey, we win. And then we just uh, use the ox as our carry. Dude, worst, worst melon in the game right there. Oh my god, the sheeps! <laughs> oh yeah, dude. Let's go. When you just have all the sheeps ever. Easy peasy. No. We upgrade sheep. Turkey! Thank you! Mm, what's that sexy smell? Mm. Whoa, what are you doing here? Oh, you're not for eating. Let me make sure I understand what you want. You're saying I need to fuck you before my body completely shuts down? 
Oh, you busted your trussing, you dirty bird. Yeah, I'm surprised I knew that word too. Oh yeah, you want that gravy? Oh yeah, you do? Oh, my gravy boat's so full of gravy. Oh yeah. Get stuff! This is going really, really well. I'm getting a little, I got a little excited there, but it's going very, very well. Uh, I am kind of worried about putting him up front though. Cause if he spawns a sheep, it's only, it's not gonna give me that much value. I'm gonna freeze the pair and roll. Penguin? Oh, shite, mate. Shitey, matey. We get rid of the ox for a penguin? Fugma. Do we just get rid of the horse, actually? It's two attack, man. Get the horse out of my face. Get the horse out of my damn face. No one even likes you, horse. I'm gonna go... I think ox is our carry here. Am I wrong? And we put the penguin up front. This is perfect. The penguin's not only buffing the sheep right now. We put the penguin up front. If the spider does spawn a sheep, uh, it does still get the two sheeps off. So that's great. Um, oh, perfect. Beer perfection. Perfection incarnate. Oh, yeah. Easy clap, dude. Um... Well, I mean, this spawns. This this is a win. Except the problem is, is that the fucking honey badger is in the game. Um, sorry, I got a little upset there. I got a little triggered at honey badgers. Okay, another. Okay, that's fine. A cow. That's very beautiful. So we do have a problem here. The ox. Uh, something has to go so we can bring in buffers every once in a while. I guess it's the ox. I've made a mistake by investing in the ox. That was uh, oopsie on my part. So now the question is, who's our carry? Is it the sheep? I guess so. I guess the sheep is our main carry. Interesting. A snail. Boom. When we sell the snail and grab, we either grab a garlic, which would be acceptable, or like a blowfish. I'm gonna grab a garlic though. I think garlic's aight. Yeah, well, that's not good. Well, it still wins, I think. No way, actually. Dude. Dude, no ways. Um, we lose this. Bruh. Uh, it's the honey badgers in the back. All right, we still have one more chance. I think we actually might be able to come back here. We just need some good pets in this round. Another turkey, which is great. Uh, we can either go for a level two turkey, which I think is the way to go. Also, a skunk is really good. Oh, a fly! Okay. That's a lot of crocodiles, by the way. I kind of want the skunk, though, man. I don't know if I want to get rid of the skunk. Well, we have a really good summoner build going. Easy. Oh, and it actually, it still survives. Oh, shit. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Damn. This is actually still incredibly strong. This is like the perfect standard issue, perf standard issue, perfect summoner build. Like, I don't know what else to call this. Do you want to get a... Wow, we have a monkey. Uh, I think we level up the flies ASAP, because that's a 10-10, so like nothing's really going to get in the way. And if we get them strong enough, so right now he's at 8. Hopefully this lands in the back. I think we just keep these units, man. And hopefully we get some buffs for the penguin. Damn, it didn't hit anything I wanted. There's a sheep buff. Here's the thing, though. I really need this guy to be a 9-9. You're asking why? It's because so if a crocodile snipes him, he still has 1 HP. Oh, wait, never mind. He was going to get both of the penguin. Eh, well, you know. Yep, see, Mosquito and the Crocodile, that's what I was thinking about. I was thinking about that exact combination. Damn. Alright. Oh my god, this is actually crushing. Absolutely crushing. How many backline batteries have we seen this round? This run? Like, four? Was that the fourth one? Guys, calm down with that shit, okay? A dragon. Well, in order to get a dragon, we have to get rid of two units. Uh, how good is the spider? Not really that good. That's a good point. A monkey. Do this. And I guess this. I don't know what else to do. Hopefully we don't fight fight any 50-50s with garlic armor, you know? That's pretty close, though. <laughs> Ouch, that hurt, man. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Interesting. And you're gonna kill your own friend? Wait a minute, that was one one. I'm sorry about that, man. I'm sorry about summoning, like, four sheeps on you like that, dog. <laughs> sorry about that. Imagine we get a level 3 turkey, though. Ooh, a melon. But who do we put it on? Probably the sheep. Because he is the strongest. A fly for a level 2 fly. And a gorilla. Let's do this. That's perfect. Everything is plus one, plus one. Dude, we're not getting any penguins, man. Give me some penguins. I'll we'll summon a fly. Oh, you summon a fly. Okay, damn it. It was a bad time to summon a fly. We got sheep again! Holy hell! We're destroying! This isn't even close, dude! This isn't even remotely close. Hopefully we don't, uh, run into... 
Any um, Rhino builds? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Do we get rid of the Penguin for that? Do we get rid of the Penguin for the Tiger? I think we do, right? I think we get rid of the Penguin for the Tiger. Oh, man, though. Because, like, we're not going to be able to summon anything now. Because when they die, they're not going to summon the Fly. If the Fly doesn't get its... If it doesn't tr actually go off, does it still trigger it? That's the question. I don't know. We're going to try it out. It's worth it. Do this. Boom, boom. Roll. Nothing good. A mushroom. A mushroom. All right, hopefully this works out. Uh, if it doesn't work out, it looks like we might not ever be able to spawn a fly is the problem. All right, we did spawn one fly. Did we lose? No, we lose. Our turkey is strong that it's actually cucked our built. That's actually not worth it at all. Don't do that. Getting rid of the tiger. Tiger ain't worth it, man. Tiger just ain't worth it there at all. That didn't that didn't do anything for us. I think this is absolutely the way to go. Am I wrong about that? No, I'm not. Freeze, freeze, roll once. All right. Um, pair. Who would a pair be best on? Uh, probably the sheep, right? I don't think our turkey's in danger of getting sniped. This is all coming out of this moment. So I'm gonna do that. Mushroom mammoth, pretty good. You better get my level three turkey, man. That's just unfortunate. Um, too bad I don't care, sir. <laughs> you think I give a shit? <laughs> Oh wait, oh my, it doesn't spawn back though because of the fly. Oh, that's actually just big pee pee suck. That sucks the big, big pee pees, as they say. Um, I don't think he has a chance of beating me here, does he? Not even remotely close, dude. Actually, pathetic try. Pathetic try! That is literally the picture perfect ultimate summoner build, legitimately. That was it, dude. That was summon 101 perfection. Mwah.